Hey miners, welcome to my channel Take No Savior. So guys, in today's video, I'll tell you how to mine Vivo coin. So for that, we need three things. First is we have to create a wallet. Second is we need a miner, which is CC miner. And third is a mining pool. So before getting into details, let me just quickly tell you why did I choose Vivo coin to mine? So for that, let me just take you into the website that is uh, whattomine.com. So as you can see, it is within the profitable list for mining. So if I click on Vivo, uh, you can see here, as I had explained in my previous video, that you can find all the details. But if I take you into its website, so you can see here that it's a master node and it is ASIC resistant. So I can mine it through my graphics card. Okay guys, so now let me just quickly tell you uh, how to mine the Vivo coin. So as I mentioned previously, the first is we have to get a wallet of our own. So let me just take you down. Okay. So as you can see here uh, in the official website of Vivo, there is the option to download the wallet over here. So depending upon the windows, what you have, you can just click on it and then start the download process. So guys, since I have already downloaded the wallet, so I will just show you how it looks like. Yeah, so this is my uh, Vivo Core wallet. Let me just minimize this. Yeah. So the first option being the overview. So here you can find out what is the available Vivo amount or the pending and the total Vivo amount. And then getting into the second tab, that is the send option. So if you want to send the Vivo coin to some other person, then you can mention the address of the receiver over here and then type the amount of uh, what you want to send to the receiver and then you can click on send. So now getting into the third tab that is receive. So what you have to do is you can give any uh, name over here and then click on request payment. So once you click on uh, request payment, uh, address will be generated. So like you can see, uh, after following that process, an address has been created over here. So now if I double click on this, you can see this is the address what had been created for me against the name what I had mentioned over here. So let me just close it. So now moving on to the fourth tab that is transactions. So as you can see here, all the transaction data is being listed down. So here uh, you can find out like uh, some time back I had uh, sent few Vivo coin to Cryptopia and that has been mentioned over here and uh, these all Vivo coins is being added to my account through mining. So this was about the wallet. Now taking you into the second point that is uh, downloading of CC miner. So now after getting into the ccminer.org, what we have to do is, as you can see this option, it is compatible with Linux and Windows. So you have to click on releases and the new tab opens. Okay, so now as you can see, uh, there are a few options over here. So depending upon the Windows, what you're having, you have to click on it and then start the download process and finally extract it. So since I have already downloaded it, so I will uh, take you directly into the folder. Okay guys, so this is the CC Miner folder. So uh, since I have already created the batch file, so you can see this over here. But what we have to do is we have to link the CC Miner with the pool and I'll just quickly show you how to do it. So guys, as you can see, this is the website uh, bitcointalk.org wherein you will get all the information about the pool. So going down here, Okay, so here you can see if you want to get any information about the master node, then you can find from here. But uh, getting down. So here you can find a lot of options about the pool. So here there are a lot of options as you can see it. But what uh, I have done is I have selected the alt minor pool. And as you can see, its uh, commission is also less. So that's, uh, that was one of the reasons why I selected this. So what I'll do is I will copy this uh, from here and then 
paste it in a notepad. So guys, now it is the important point. So what we have to do is we have to link the CC minor with the pool. And for the linking purpose, what we have to do is we have to copy this name as you can see it here. And then go back to notepad and then paste it here and give a space before the dash A. And then now you can see here uh, there is a point called you, your Vivo wallet address. So for that we have to go get into the wallet and then get into the third tab and as you had created already an address of your own so you have to double click on this and then copy the address and then again get back to the notepad okay and from you have to select the whole thing and then paste it and finally what you have to do is you have to save as Okay, you have to save as into the same folder but guys you have to save it in the batch file format so you whatever name you have to give you will give it with followed by dot bat so guys as you can see here a batch file has been created so guys, after the batch file has been created, what you have to do is you just have to double click on this and then the mining starts. So as you can see here, it has mentioned like welcome to altminer.net and happy mining. And then it has detected all the three graphics card of mine. And then in no time, the mining will get started. So guys, as you can see, the mining has started off and uh, you can also see the hash rate for all the graphics card together. So now let me just quickly take you into the MSI afterburner and uh, show you how my overclocking settings are. So as you can see for my first graphics card that is GTX 1070, these are the settings what I have kept with the core clock of 125 and memory clock of 0. Okay guys, so let me just quickly take you into the website once again so that I can show you how you can uh, monitor the statistics of your rig. So what you have to do is uh, you just have to click on the more information of the pool what you have selected and then after you click on to this you have to get into the wallet and uh, get back to the wallet and uh, double click, copy the address, get back to the website and then paste it hit on submit okay so as you can see here uh, you you will find the all the information like uh, the total unpaid total paid and total earned vivo coins and uh, then you will find out the last 24 hour payouts and uh, over here in this column you can find the last 50 earnings and here you can find out few graphs as well and then finally here you can see how much hash rate you are getting uh, since I just uh, started the mining as of now, so the hash rate is low. Okay, so these are the statistics what you can find once you get into this uh, website. So guys, this is how you have to start mining the Vivo coin. So hope this video was helpful. And if you uh, feel it was informative, then do not forget to like, share and subscribe to my channel Techno Savior. Thank you and happy mining.